Hey guys, it's Darius. And Przemo. And we are Wild Mesh. We are a 3D sculpting service that specializes in sculpting miniatures for miniature war games, board games, and all that stuff. We are a new brand that's coming up right now, but we have two years experience working with a brand you might be familiar with, Whiskits. Yes, we have sculpted almost 3,000 projects for them. And we would like to invite you to our new Patreon. Patreon. So, so, what is this Patreon about? This Patreon is about community. This is the foundation. It's community focused around miniatures. So we'll be sculpting miniatures. We'll be sharing our knowledge about preparing and sculpting miniatures, preparing STLs for prints, and we'll have STLs ready for you as well. So you can print them. They will be pre-supported. They will be without the support, if you, whatever you prefer. And we'll share uh, our experience with you, but we will have tutorials, streams, we'll have polls, so we'll have discussions, and uh, hopefully we will create something great together. Yes, there's gonna be a Discord channel, which uh, you will have access to as a Patreon, and you will be participating in discussions, sharing your ideas, inspirations, and giving us feedback about the miniatures that we should uh, sculpt. The uh, main idea how we want to work with this is First contact with you, then a 2D concept, your feedback, back to you again, and then starting to sculpt. Also, sometimes with your participation during some online streaming Twitch events like live sculpting, live painting, this is going to be mainly community driven. This is our goal to start sharing our skills that we acquired from those two years of work and it's going to be a wild adventure. Yeah. Join us. We've prepared a Wild Wave 1 for you guys. It consists of 15 miniatures. We'll be showcasing 14 of them uh, in this video. Um, it's all print ready, pre-supported. For your convenience, you can print it with, without the support if you like. And uh, this is what we got. Also, we have uh, painted all the miniatures already. And the painted minis will be taking part in a giveaway for all the new Patreons that will start really, really soon. So if you're gonna get your hands on some of those minis, be sure to subscribe to us. So Frank, what kind of miniatures have we prepared? On the menu, three savage gladiators. Oh, here they are. Mighty futuristic knights. You can add to your collection of badass fighters. Yeah, they are equipped with two Powerful chain axes and a power armor as you can see. Oh, I really like the poses on this guy. Those have been painted by Dawn of Imagination Here at the studio What's up next? Swarm Three hive sprocks this Nightmarish minions will add extra vibe to your dark sci-fi or horror setup. Yeah, they come with STL prepared separate hands and separate heads so you can uh, use the same head for all your little aliens or mix and match it to create different poses and uh, to make this swarm even bigger not just three miniatures but create a bigger bat batch of them mm -hmm. and still they would could be different so you, you can, for example, use hands of this one and fit them to this body. And also you can use this head over here. They are all prepared so they mix and match very well. And also a little special bonus. This yeah. Cthulhu looking alien head. This one is my favorite from, from the whole Wild Wave 1. I will take your soul. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's next? Wild Bunch. This is a bigger one. Yeah. A more diverse group as well. Okay. For example, let's start with Rogue Dark Elf. Here he is in a very dynamic pose. He comes with a attachable head, so it's printed uh, separately. And you can use any different head you have on your bits box and make him uh, something different. I would like to see that. What kind of different miniatures are you able to come up with? from our STLs. Cyber Cowboy. Cyber Cowboy. This is a badass, wild west, I mean, wild space dude. 
yeah, he comes with two revolvers. Uh, you can use him for for a board game, for a sci-fi RPG game. It's a really nice miniature. Sorcerers flying on the magic beam, looking all empowered. Or you can paint her a different way and use her as an energetic god creature. Okay, Nuri Botoke. And this guy, human fish hybrid. What do you think, Derek, about him? Uh, I really like the eye detail popping up. Mm. <laughs> and another one, Japanese one. Yeah. Yeah, you can use this in a D&D game as an adversary. Options are limitless. I would really like to see uh, where this is going to be used. Wow. This guy, he's a sting of chaos. Oh yeah, and if you thought that his front side is scary... <laughs> Look at the back side. Yeah, try to chase him. <laughs> And the final one? Mm hmm. That's a Fly Lord Beast. Oh, yeah. He reminds me of the uh, film yeah. with uh, Jeff Goldblum. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is our Jeff Goldblum. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, this was the Wild Wave one. As you can see, all the miniatures are very wild, so there's a theme here. <laughs> so are we. Uh, please join our Patreon page if you want to be a part of this community and uh, help us create even more awesome miniatures. Thank you for tuning in and let's get wild! wild.